Thank all the family and being here that could make it here that made it very possible to be here this evening uh, for this beautiful memorial, Dia de los Muertos, of all our family members, especially all our ancestors that are born, that were buried here. And uh, I know it takes a lot to take off your schedule, but it's beautiful. And if they, I'm sure they're all looking down upon each and every one of you and thanking you all from the bottom of their hearts. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Come on down, Johnny.
Gracias a Dios, los tiempos han cambiado. Ay, hoy queremos darle las gracias a nuestros antepasados por lo que hicieron. Las familias Herrera, ¿dónde están los Herrera? Rafael Cantu en Israel Longoria. Limón, Tracy, Moreno, I'm Moreno. And uh, Vasquez, Peggy Vasquez, right here. Oh, Peggy, Peggy, okay. Nosotros de Maripa también. Nosotros nos dan la bienvenida. Nuestros antepasados entraron en Oakwood Cemetery. Están aquí en nuestra ofrenda. Right here. The ones that are buried here are right here. Mm. It is, so I'll translate now. It is with great pleasure and honor that the Herrera, Limon, Moreno, Vasquez, and Samaripa families welcome you to the resting site of our ancestors. 
our grandparents, great grandparents and great great grandparents pictured on this altar are buried here. We are ever so thankful for them for though they lived in turbulent times, their strength and invincible spirit lives within us. Mm -hmm. It has powered us through good times and bad. Dia de los Muertos is a celebration of honor and recognition. While most of us, many of us Mexican Americans did not grow up with this custom, we have wholeheartedly adopted and embraced this cultural celebration. Let's see, let's see, I wanna, my speech, not too much longer. <laughs> Dia de los Muertos is a time when the souls of our ancestors return to reunite with family. We offer them the best. Fresh flowers, you'll see Mary goes all over. Mm -hmm. Colorful papel picado, which you really can't see, but it's it's against the fence yeah, over there. There's some. Okay, there, right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And their favorite foods. Well, of course, we brought beer and tequila. <laughs> <laughs> we have some tamales there and uh, you're welcome. Some okay. here. Cerveza. So, yes. That's right. <laughs> and some, I put some nuts there. <laughs> I know that they wanted more, but because they <laughs> lived such a long time ago, there's a lot about them that we don't know. <laughs> we don't know how far they've traveled or how tired these souls are. So it is especially important for them to drink, to quench their thirst, as well as food to sustain them. Thank you, Lena. It was in grief that I came to embrace the other Los Muertos. Mm. A Presbyterian minister who is a dear friend suggested I build an ofrenda. Mm. She guided me through the process. My ofrenda sat outside on our porch. Every morning I would bring my breakfast, my coffee, and my newspaper and sit by the ofrenda. Mm. Sometimes as long as two hours. And during that time, it felt like my parents, my aunt and uncle, who were like my grandparents, mm -hmm. and my dog Speedy were there comforting Aww. me. It really did. Mm -hmm. I felt their love and affection. It was soothing. We have an ofrenda on our porch again, and this year, this year, and I recommend ofrendas to others who are grieving loved ones. Mm -hmm. And so I do appreciate your coming here. Uh, we, family members, primos, cousins, are here because we've lost we've lost family members. Some of us come from very large families. My parents had 14 kids. There's 13 of us living. We're all practicing Catholics, right, Carmen? <laughs> right, <laughs> devout. <laughs> Her parents had 20, 20 children. 20 children. Wow. All single births. That's right. Amazing. And my grandparents had 12. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pardon me? No, no TV. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> they live by the railroad tracks. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Woke them up all this time. So, uh, but the people at the top, and we are missing your your parents, uh, your grandmother. It, they, it was I here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Do you want to put it here, Peggy? I will. Okay, so we uh, the ones at the top are those that that started it all, uh, and uh, and, there, and some of them are buried here, and then the others are their children uh, that have most of them are no longer here. Everybody that is pictured here is gone. So um, I'm sure that if you want to ask any questions of any of us. We can certainly answer them individually or as a whole, but I greatly appreciate your coming and uh, honoring this celebration with us. Oh my gosh, that's right. That's so important. <laughs> but we can't offer the beer or the tequila, but we have lots of tamales. <laughs> we have a cousin uh, uh, who's taking care of his uh, uh, very ill mother, and that's his whole source of income. And we have some hot chocolate and cookies from the best place in Boston to have uh, Mexican sweet bread, and that's Joe's Bakery. So, yes, and yes, 
Can we do an Our Father and a Hail Mary for us? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. That's okay. You're welcome to participate, but you don't have to. Well, to acknowledge all the people who are here that are unknown and their family members are not here. That's right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Who would like to? Carmen? Yes. Carmen leads uh, uh, the rosary at a lot of our funerals when relatives die. We always call on Carmen and and her sister to lead the rosary. So if you could say an Our Father and a Hail Mary. And okay. okay, in the name of the Father, Father and of the Son, and of, Son and of the Holy Spirit, Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. And, and then now we'll hear, continue listening to some music from Jorge Tamayo and El Primo. And his assistant. Well, boy. Well, boy. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.